we are doing something a little different. We're doing a nice, fun one-shot called The Smoky Bandits, A Star Wars Story. <laughs> I thought we were going to do like a, a pun on it, like the, I don't know, the smoggy... Oh, no, don't worry. I've got some names. I've got some names. Oh, he's got some names. Okay. So, uh, this is during our old, a little bit uh, after our Old Republic game that's currently going on. So, a little bit of events have already passed that we have not played yet. So, I'm, I'm going to try to keep spoilers from that story out. So, we randomized who plays what. Yep. I'm, I'm the only smuggler, and we have two heroes. <laughs> You're um, all heroes. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, Everyone's a hero in their own way. So it's just like Captain. I'm Hammer. a droid thief. That's just what I rolled. So yeah, I did. I would never have played this otherwise. Which is do you have ones. a name that you want? I to go don't. By? So what I'm doing now is I'm taking recommendations on <laughs> who, <laughs> what, and how I'm playing this character. So am I going to be another gonk droid, or am I going to do something different? <laughs> like, what's another laughably useless type of droid? Oh, hold on. In the Star Wars. I bought you play a drawer that accidentally memory wipes itself every odd hour. Uh, so memory loss. <laughs> I have a RAM leak. <laughs> <laughs> it's because you it's because you study so hard and you do those cramp sessions, so it has to leak out eventually. Touche. Memory dump. Yeah, Touche. Yeah. <laughs> like uh, I said, cramp sessions are so the RAM. Hold on, hold on. Uh, let's Google um like gumpy doofy. I mean, there's mouse droids. Mouse droids. Is that the? That's, <laughs> yep. I'm gonna be a villain mouse droid who loses his memory every odd hour. <laughs> I probably never got RAM. I'm so small. Like yeah, <laughs> it's probably just all the hard drive. Uh, okay. Now oh, let's uh let's uh, also brainstorm at least one or two more options, and yeah. then I'll I'll land on one. So uh, I'm gonna Google stupid. While you're looking at a list, we can kind of introduce I'm everybody Google else. Stupid. <laughs> All right. So let's while we're waiting on some other choices, what what's your character? Oh, all right. So my, I got from the random roll a uh, human commando. <clears throat> the only do, human. I, I do apologize. I am really basic. My stats are really basic. Everybody's stats are pretty really basic. <laughs> you're level ones essentially. Except there's no levels in this there's game. There's no levels in the game. But, uh, so, I don't know how to play this character. I'm, like, I'm in Josh's position. Any suggestions? Or any gender criteria going on? I don't... Honestly, <laughs> it's your character. Male, female, <laughs> trans, whatever. <laughs> Not true. I'm gonna... Uh, I'm gonna go with an oldish kind of male with a beard who tells wartime stories of his past experience. Okay, so you're... That word always gets cut off by everybody else who's tired of hearing this shit. Yes, yeah. that. <laughs> like, everybody's heard most of these stories like a hundred times, and they're just like, yeah, And yeah. then finish my story for me. <laughs> yeah, they're like, whatever, old man. So you're probably, like, in your 50s. Yeah. You've seen The Mandalorian, and, I mean, you've probably seen all the wars that... I see, well, majority of the, Well, I would say all the wars. All the, the wars that have The occurred. significant ones that's current, yeah. Yeah, like Mandalorian, Jedi Civil War... Uh, probably even the Sith War, which was before the Mandalorian War. So I've probably been a young trooper trying to get my badge that day. <laughs> <laughs> so I just found an article on Gizmodo, 10 Stupid Droids, and there's one Thank comment you know, at the very well. bottom, and it says, what about Gonk? <laughs> Alright, so, Jeff, wait, you got the Rodian. Um, yeah, I'm trying to pull up. I'm, try I'm, well, I'm trying to find where my download folder is. What are you getting uh, ready for with our loading? practice uh nothing particular but uh yeah you're a rhodian medic so you're the healer of the group what's a rhodian that's the ones like greedo from uh new hope the one that han shot oh, oh the little green dudes with the sucker faces yeah they look like a big fly yeah <sighs> Although they're, I think they're supposed to be more reptilian. Okay. Or, no, I, no, no, I know your character twist, Jeffrey. Greedo shot first. <laughs> so. <laughs> You're okay, so your name is Guido. <laughs> oh, that doesn't make any sense to the lore. Okay. Does that mean wait? His name that, is no, no, no. Can I, add, can I please Guido. add it? That probably explains why Guido missed first because he was yeah. specified as a medic. Can he wasn't please, really trained. Can I please add, a, add more to what your suggestion is? Yeah, but then I have another point, which is that he was part of a crime family and now he's <laughs> <laughs> so your offspring tried to shoot Han Solo and he failed. 
Okay, but also check this out. You're a medic because what you're actually doing whenever you're healing people is stealing their bodily fluids. (laughs) They don't do that, Josh. That's insane. (laughs) Their species don't do that. So basically, I'm just going to run up to Dan and be like, piss in my mouth. No, <laughs> like you're a mosquito man, right? So like whenever you're no, using no, them, you're... That's not how it works. No, that's not how they are. But wait, here's the doctor, so we just use the syringe to just distract the blood. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah, yeah you don't have to like suck it out. You, you have know. a very Franken... <laughs> okay, just how about you have a blood. very frankenstein <laughs> approach to healing common wounds? How the hell is he going to approach so, droids? So like if he, he gets like a cut or something, you're going to be like, Oh, I know how to fix this, and you pull out like a piece of metal and a welder. <laughs> <laughs> But, uh, are you playing male or female or anything uh, special I need to know? Let's go with female. Okay. Okay, your name is Greedo. <laughs> Do you have, like, a name you, you, you were thinking of? Mm, not particularly. Okay. Weedo? You could be a high medic. Mm. Weedo. Mm. I kind of like that. Mm. So, so how the hell... Good. Yeah, we're okay. going with Weedo. All right, so we got Weedo and then No Name. Oh, No Name. Oh shoot. Call me Grandpa Max. Grandpa Max. Okay. Grandpa Max. Weedo and Grandpa Max. Okay, so I have a few ideas for my character. Okay. Either I'm gonna do a mouse droid, and like I don't know what's going on. <laughs> um, so it'd be hard to role play a mouse droid, but that's a, on the on the list because I love him. Um, or. Grandpa Maximus Stargaze. Oh, a sentient forklift. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, know what he's, <laughs> I know what he's talking about. The T1LB <laughs> units. Like, uh, LB from the Knights of the Old Republic comics. Yeah, I know what you're saying. <laughs> Should we give him, like, a little, like, a, a prize grapple hand? Let's see, I mean, that... A little claw machine grapple. <laughs> I mean, he's gotta have, like, a... He's gotta be able to steal, though, because it's a thief. So you gotta... Yeah, just, like, try to, like, maneuver the claw into the pockets. <laughs> it's like a claw machine. Yeah. Yeah, go with that. <laughs> you have like a little arm that goes down trying to grab it. It'd be really delicate. <laughs> this is stupid. How do I play this? <laughs> yeah, we're doing this. Josh, you got this. You have to send me a picture. Of what I'm playing, playing an old okay. senile man. <laughs> is this a, I don't have one. I can't. Android? There's not one I can find that has the claw thing. But Are you just talking about this guy? No. Cause that's dumb. <laughs> no, no, no. No, oh, no. dang. Trust me, it's, it'll be so much cooler. Oh, dang. It'll be cool, but still dumb. <laughs> so dumb. At least it'll be fun. To me, cool and dumb sounds fun. Is there a way I can just. Yeah, I can open the image in a new tab and then send it that way, can I? I think so. I mean, it can't be harder than Donk Joy. He's a walking battery. No, this one will be a little bit easier. Although you don't... Loader... Hey, loader droids, they don't come with voice modulators, do they? So you won't be able to talk right away. Well, I'm a unique model. You, I mean, that you can add one, so... <laughs> the dude. captain retrofitted me to be his co-pilot. <laughs> oh, no, he's got a co-pilot. Damn it, this isn't the backstory. You're his loader droid. You put all the cargo into the ship. Okay, open the image. Open. Open. Uh, I don't know if it'll show the way I want it to. Though. Yeah, and we'll let me open it. Or is that just the full image? That's the full image. Yeah. Yep. I can't open it. Like, I can't get a full view. Oh. Uh, I can show you from my end. Oh, I got it. Okay, cool. Yeah, he's pretty cool. Big arm butt. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that's what you're working with. So I guess we're ready now. Is this is the game? Mm hmm. Is he dead yet? No. I mean, this attack. Oh, no, he's not dead. But that attack took forever. Anyway. You'll, you'll like a character that's being introduced, but you'll be upset because he's not on your side. Oh, son of a bitch. All right. So, you're hanging out with... Uh, we're going to start with Josh. So, you're ca- hanging out with Captain Rogue Barvel. Captain Rogue? Rogue Barvel. Rogue. Rogue. R-O. Okay. <laughs> Rogue Barvel. Can I call him Robo for short? Yeah, sure. <laughs> uh... 
He's the captain of the Smoky Bandits, and he's got his second mate, Fritz Seed. <laughs> Fritz Seed. Robo and Fritz Seed. Uh, so you guys are just hanging out on the planet of Rishi. It's this pirate world, world smuggler type world. A world of pirates. Yeah. Okay. And so you're kind of just finishing, you guys just recently finished up a job, and suddenly there's a call. <laughs> Uh, the captain uh, clicks the little button to get the video going, the hologram going, and you see, see before you a human-looking android. He is wearing the mark of the uh, exchange on his uniform, and you can kind of tell he works for the exchange in some way. Um, so my facial recognition <laughs> software doesn't work, so any humanoid I see... I just think they're all the same person. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Captain, it's Captain talking. No, 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 no. Uh, did we ever come up with a name? Oh, for my character? Yeah. No. Um, Bebop. <laughs> Bebop. I like Bebop. <laughs> <laughs> all right. No, no, no. Bebop. It's fine. This is uh, Asen from the Exchange. He stole my name. I didn't steal it. It's exactly that character. Oh, God. <laughs> I said it wasn't that Oh, one. you said from the exchange. Never mind. Duh. So, Asen says, That's right. Um, I'm calling because I have a job for you. So, there's a, a deal of, uh, that I have set on Rishi that we need to be able to get some stuff brought over to Narshida. And I've heard how good of a crew you have. Question. The captain and first mate, what are they? Uh... Captain is human, first mate is undecided. So I just think humans are the captain. <laughs> That'll work. Okay. <laughs> That's my twist. <laughs> yeah. Because the first mate is some sort of alien. Um, we'll go with Quarren. They're like the squid looking Perfect. people. Alright. So. I'm blue over here. <laughs> Uh, so he says, yeah, there's a load of spice that, uh, I need you to pick up for me and bring over to Narshida. Should be an easy run, uh, as long as you don't get caught by any law enforcement. Uh, 80,000 credits. And Ro looks over to you and Fritz. Uh, how's that sound to you guys? Hot damn, that's gonna pay for my retirement. Uh, I'm guessing that's Fritz. Uh... Um, screen bop. <laughs> <laughs> That's a yes. <laughs> What's funny is... Bebop what a, says bebop. Yeah. Bebop. <laughs> That's all he says, and so the captain has to interpret. And I just like, clink, 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 <laughs> clink, grab my claws greedily. Clink, clink, clink. That's definitely a yes. All right, perfect. Uh, you should be able to meet, uh, meet up with a contact there and pick up the spice and make your way. All right. Uh, he hangs up and he says, all right, crew, we got a job. Let's go meet up. And we're going to cut away from you as you guys are making your way to the hang meet up. Meanwhile, law enforcement on Rishi. Uh, where are you guys up to? You guys are kind of just on, like, on guard duty right now. On... You're kind of used to the pirates and scum that are on this planet. But you also try to keep some law enforcement. I guess we would just be on patrol. You know what, Weedo? We haven't seen much action anymore. Back in my day during the Man Eleven War, a lot of gunfire, but lasers everywhere. Oh boy, that was a time. I remember when the laser shot me right in my goddamn face. Yes, Frank, I remember that. I was right with there with you. We know you miss a lot, you rookie. You see my scar? You see my scar? There's Frank, Frank, there. calm down, Frank. Calm down. <laughs> calm down. <laughs> but we, uh, we're we glad to have you on patrol with us, you rookie. All right, and that's when the uh, captain of the militia walks in and says, All right, boys, we got a job. Heard some word that the exchange is trying to get some spice from here. How the hell do you turn this volume up? I can't even hear him. Oh no, he's actually in the room. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he just rolls up to this man, like turns his nipple a little bit, like trying to turn the volume up. What do you, what do you think you're doing, boy? 
takes uh, your hat and he start, throws it to the ground. What do you think you're doing, boy? I thought you were a hologram, sir. So my apologies. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. He picks up your hat and That's takes it back to you. That's how you turn a hologram. Thank God. By the way, you should probably wear an extra shirt there, lad. Oh, he's, he's Scottish now. <laughs> <laughs> Old man Scottish. So, uh... So, as I was saying, the exchange is trying to move some spice from here. We can't allow for that. We can't allow them to get away with that. I And I say it's about time we stop them from getting... What do you say? I'm so biased I think he's right now. Something. I don't know if you should have said something. I think he's said. something. You know what? I'm tired of these damn smugglers always getting one over on us. It's like they own the fucking cops. I'm with Frank on this, y'all, man. These damn young whippersnappers and their drugs sniffing and, and taking and dying. Well, and... we're going to stop them before they even get off world. I heard where they're supposed to meet. And Nobody gonna... gets high on our watch. And we're going to get to them before they can get off planet. Right to that, so we'll, we'll, we'll get this done. Alright, so he sends you the location. This is perfect, guys. This is my last mission before my retirement. <laughs> <laughs> Two days to retirement. <laughs> I like the trope, man. Bonus points. <laughs> oh, oh, speaking of, I forgot. We gotta do our destiny roll. <laughs> Uh, go ahead and do the Destiny roll. Can you, like, actually be retired? Like, you're already retired, but, like, you were so bored at home that you just kept coming to work. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about how you're... So, so you're, you're you just hope nobody so notices Frank, that you so are. Is, is, is Frank Weeboo's partner? I'm, I'm just here. <laughs> what do you got? A light. All right, so that's one light. Where's the... Where's the little token? There's one light. Two light. Two light. So who uses Two more lights? lights? Uh, well, yeah, we gotta figure out who's... I think they have light points because they're cops and I have light points. Yeah, oh, I get one. <laughs> oh, Alright. And in case you guys know it, not that you should. I don't think I'm getting away. <laughs> Alright. So... I might die, so... Well, the, the way I explained it to Dan is really you're both good. It's more of their lawful good and your chaotic good. No, I'm not good. I'm a robot. You were programmed for good. I lack empathy. But do you have sympathy? No, I'm a robot. Because I would argue, I would argue <laughs> that's not bad. Yeah, robots can feel sorry, they just can't put mm. themselves in our shoes. He just does bad things sometimes. Hindsight. They can't feel empathy. But I would argue he's more chaotic good than anything. Would I be on track with that for mm. Asen? No, I know B9 I, is evil, but Ace and I'd argue well, is less I think so. Ace and slowly becoming like him now. Oh, okay. You're playing Frank, too. <laughs> so would you think, like, maybe a year after that he'd be more evil? Yeah. Okay. So then, yeah, you're probably I, I think evil. he would start to show his, his true side. Like, I've been trying to play him quiet when yeah. I do play him. Well, like, I have a canonical explanation for my evil. Like, I have no empathy because I'm a robot. I didn't get that patch. Right. Okay. Does not I, never got, I, re, I never got the empathy download. I was going to say, because robots Like, if a human Wars, is dying, I'm just, like, poking them. Because I was, was going to say, robots in Star Wars Universe can have empathy. It's just... Yeah, I never got that, that update. Yeah. You sure it's empathy or sympathy? Don't get those two confused. Empathy is the ability to feel... Like, it's probably sympathy. Yeah, it's probably yeah, sympathy. And thing. sympathy is feeling sorry for It's someone. probably sympathy. Like, I have neither of those. Although R2 could be empathetic. No one R2. Uh, C three PO on the other hand C is sympathy. C C yeah, that, that's the best way to describe. I have none of the above. All right. Anyways, so you both make it at the same time. You guys are just outside when you see uh, Rose crew showing up, and you guys know about Rose. He, he's a he's somebody that you guys go after a lot. Gosh, Danny and Frank, you need to slow the hell down before I have to give you a ticket. <laughs> We're cops. <laughs> That's not how this works. That's not how any of this works. You're supposed to be a good role model to Weebo over here. Right, I'm going to reach over and just tighten his fucking belt. <laughs> hey now, hey now, hey now. It probably was loose, you know, the old man trope. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Trying and, to get injured on the job. Anyways, uh, so let's go ahead. You see them going inside, and you see this giant droid going in with them. Uh, so inside. Damn, I bet that droid is fucking awesome. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
So inside, uh, on the smuggler side, you guys meet up with this, you see this uh, Deveroni, and it kind of looks like a devil. It has horns, and it's red skin, and no tail, though. Are we talking about the devil from Futurama? No. Okay. But uh, he looks over, and he says, You guys, the ones... Uh, you hear that fella that caught out of the bull's butt talks? Wait, we walked into a place and we're talking to a devil robot? Uh, no, 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 not <laughs> a robot. A devil robot. Robot, hell. A devaronian. Is okay. The, yeah. So, it's an alien race. So the captain will talk to him. Yeah. 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 Okay. Um, yeah, we're we're here for the, the ASIN. Ah, good. Good, good, good. Uh, well, he already sent the payment, so here. And he kicks a little crate over to you guys. It's already on like a hover sled. So that way it can be moved easily. I'm gonna okay. open the crate and sample. Frank! Sample this place. Oh, no, no, no. This is the <laughs> oh, okay. side. I'm, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm me it. now. <laughs> <laughs> Frank, what are you doing? <laughs> no, but you guys are probably watching this go down kind of like... Why am I Frank? <laughs> yeah. You guys are probably watching this go down through like... What the hell I'm gonna do? I'm an old man cop. But yeah, you guys. I'm just there supervising. But yeah, you guys are probably watching through binoculars, watching this go down, so you don't Holy hear anything, shit. but you see what's going down. So you guys are just trying to confirm that this is a deal. So I'm gonna sample the spice, <laughs> and I'm gonna beat boop and stuff, and I'm gonna say like, "This is good shit." Fritz is like, "What do you What do you say, Captain?" <laughs> uh, he said, "This is good shit." <laughs> 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 Although I don't know how he knows. Uh, he this is a uh, good shit. <laughs> I don't know how he knows, but we're gonna trust him. And then it's gonna turn out later down the road that this is like some kind of like anti-rust compound that was not actually spice, and then now they know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, I guess we'll head out then. So you guys start. Uh, he looks over at you and he says, "Bebop, start loading it onto the ship." Uh, okay, so I'm going to try a uh, uh, a thief. Uh, a steal. Okay. Um, I'm gonna try to get the money off of the Devilroni. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I can't. Okay. Nice crap a little bit. Uh, <laughs> no, uh, I, you know, I used the wrong word, not steal. Mug. I am going to use my one claw. He's attempted to, to commit guy. robbery in so the third degree. stand behind the Devilroni or whatever you said he is. I'm gonna lift him by the shirt with my left hand. And then just like kidney punch him over and over again. <laughs> okay, right hand. it went from robbery third degree to robbery first degree. Okay, so go ahead and give me a. Um, buddy, that's a class B felony. Give me a bra brawl. Give me a brawl check. That's gonna be on your combat oh, okay. side of the I sheet. I haven't even looked at my sheet. And I don't know what he's going to defend against. I mean, it's just him being picked up. I mean, so, yeah, you guys see the droid pick up this guy. <laughs> we were almost out of there. Yeah, you see the... We can't just have a fucking transaction. He's got to fucking kitty stab these people. <laughs> I mean, at this point, you're, you're the captain's used to this. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. I mean, let's be honest. He had to program the thing. True. Although, why he programmed a loader droid to be a thief, who knows? <laughs> okay, so... Uh, oh, it was short staff. It's just taking me to a fucking... Reddit. Yeah, it, it, it made sure that two jobs were put into one. Is that his messenger? Yeah, yeah. I know that, but like, every time I... I can pull up for him. I've I got the stats. have PDF in here somewhere. Don't worry, I've got the stats. I can just... Mm. It's on my laptop. All right, Frank. Give me a give me a green. Yeah, you know I don't know how to use these Star Wars systems. He's got the two. I got two horseshoes. Two horseshoes. Okay. Two horseshoes. Uh, yep, you're good. So you just start <laughs> wailing into this guy. <laughs> Kidney punch. Kidney punch. <laughs> uh, eventually he's just like, <clears throat> why are you? <clears throat> Doing this, <clears throat> Aeson will hear about <clears throat> this. <clears throat> Give me the money and beat boops. <laughs> <laughs> beat me, bum, bum, bum. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> what? I thought we were watching a deal go down. <laughs> yeah, you guys are just you. You're not getting any of the audio. You're just seeing this from a distance. <laughs> seeing him pick up the Stavronian. I'm guessing by the horn and just going. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that load of droid doing this job for us? I can't even tell anymore. I, I see too much. Frank, we do. Let's move in. Oh lord, I almost tripped on my beard. <laughs> <laughs> what are you, Rip Van Winkle? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, uh, I'll give it a minute. And so how much money do I make? Do I get the whole 80k back? Yeah, you get all, well, no, no, no. That wasn't how much that he got paid for the spice. He got paid a different fee. Uh, he was paid by so, some reason. So, so somebody paid for the drugs? Yeah, Aeson paid for the drugs, and that he, now he's also paying for shipment, which is what he's right. paying you guys. Right, and then whoever we deliver the drugs to pays us the 80k. That, yeah. So I get paid, and I get the drugs, and I get paid. <laughs> I mean, if you keep right. the drugs, yeah, you get the drugs. Although, uh, if you keep the drugs, the you'll drugs. probably be killed. I want the pay. Yeah. <laughs> or whatever the droid equivalent of being killed is. Uh, yeah, you find like uh, 40, 40k on him for the spice. Cool. Right, down payment. Because I figure Ace and pays well for spice. He probably does. <laughs> I mean, he's fucking gracious shit. Huh? It's the exchange. Yeah. So is the guy alive? Uh, no. He just gives me the money? No, you, you killed him. <laughs> You didn't say you stopped welling in there. I think the droid just beat him to death. Okay, it went from assault first to just murder. <laughs> Class A felony, hands down. Okay, so at this point, Rose like, all right, we need to get out of here before the, the, the cops show up. So let's start loading it. So he starts making his way out. Just heads up, Frank and Weedo gets there first. I'm hopping it. <laughs> <laughs> well... Really, really, Frank is more of an NPC that I'm going to have to control, but yeah. Okay. But I like You're controlling Frank, I'm just talking. Yeah, that's <laughs> fine. Let's see. Yep. Okay, so as they, as you guys are about to walk out, that's when you hear, because I assume that yeah. once you get close enough, you're going to, yeah, yep. you give the little warning. I do oh. the beep boop version of, oh shit, it's the fuzz. <laughs> you got beep, boop, 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 boop. Fuzz. Ro is like, you got that right. Get cover. And he hides behind one of the crates that's in this warehouse. And he pulls out his gun to get ready. And at this point, you got uh, the cops around the corner. So we see oh, so the, the cops around the corner? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to use the dead man that I just killed. <laughs> I'm going to use his carcass as a human shield. Well, as a devil Ar Aronian shield. Yeah. Okay, so give yourself, uh, for now, a bonus. I can't see my sheet, so... Yeah. We'll, we'll just assume you have a bonus yeah, to we'll your soap. Frank has a bonus. No, 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 not Frank. The... Oh, okay, the droid. Yeah, beep boop. I thought we appeared around the corner. Yeah. Uh, and with my other arm, I'm going to start using my tube launcher. Well, I'm going to act for Frank in this. That way we can be fair and okay. balanced on that. <laughs> Otherwise, so, I'm just going to use myself, use Frank as a human shield to save your life and then go back. Which, right now, Frank is still alive. Frank, Frank be Josh beats up Josh. <laughs> I'm going to shoot a, I'm going to sh so I'm holding a body as a shield, and I'm going to use my tube launcher. Like, I, I'm at, it's like, you know, like old school, like... Uh, what are we talking about? Like Gundam? Like my claws open up and there's just a tube missile in the middle? Yeah. <laughs> I'm okay. gonna shoot a missile at Frank. Uh, <laughs> roll a green for me. <laughs> Double horseshoe. Okay, so, okay. Go ahead and roll whatever your cool is. Oh, yeah. Cool? Yep. I can pull out your sheet too if you need me to. Give me a second, I'm going to put a stab. It's been a while since I looked at the sheet. No, you're good. Uh, cool is like on the left side of the skills. And they're all in alphabetical order. 
All right, two green. All right, so roll two green. So he had two horseshoes for the advantage. One explosion, one horseshoe. All right, so you got an advantage and a success. And then go ahead and roll your pool. Uh, two green as well. Dang, better than mine. <clears throat> What'd you get? One advantage, what? two success. Yeah. So what is my character made for? Like, no, no, no. strong suit. Steel. One success, two advantage. Yeah. Okay, what what are, are my weapons? Uh, I'm just kind of. You got two advantage, one success. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. What was my most skillfully used weapon? Um. So that's advantage. That's Honestly, success. whatever weapons uh, I gave you, I gave you a right. I haven't seen the sheet, so. Okay. Nice. Okay. I gave you and uh, a. I just kind of made that stuff up. up and I yeah. gave you a uh -huh. slug thrower pistol and a Try combat knife. Trap. Trap. But you probably don't need the knife because of your fist. Let's say I got a combat claws and then a what? A slug, slug thrower pistol. What is that? It's basically a shotgun. A regular. It's a regular bullet gun pistol. Oh, okay. Because in the Star Wars universe, pistol. In the Star Wars universe, if it's a regular pistol, they call it slug throwers because they they shoot slugs instead of lasers. Weapon, energy weapons, which I gave the cops energy weapons. So I'll pump the brakes on using that missile. <laughs> uh, all right, and then let me roll for our NPCs. Actually, I have dice over here, so I'm good. I got the program that I need. Hey everyone, thank you for checking out the video. If you enjoyed what you just saw, be sure to give us a like, comment, and subscribe. If you don't want to miss any of our content, be sure to hit the bell icon where you will be notified anytime we upload a video. Also, if you wish to watch RPG Workshop live, you can follow Studio Bastion on Twitch. There, you can also enjoy his gameplay live streams and other podcasts that are in production. Also, if you like what we're doing here at Escape Reality Films, be sure to check out our Patreon and support us, and get some cool rewards in return.